Hello everybody and welcome back to Space Engineers. This is going to be somewhat a special video because of the new update. We do have the Stargate Prometheus, but look at that. We are allowed to clone stuff now. So with the simple click of a button, I can have more ships and <laughs> more stuff to crash more stuff into. So this is going to be a lot of fun for us because initially in the first video that I did, I crashed a Stargate Prometheus into, I believe, even that asteroid right there, and there just was not a lot of damage. It just did not appear to do a lot of damage to it. And I even built one of the new beacons. That was another nice thing in the update. So as you fly away, you do not have to be lost. And it looks just like a little blip on the screen, but you get closer and closer and it gets fairly bright, especially whenever it's brand new and you put that reactor on. Woo! It's blinding. So what we're also going to do, mahaha. Oh, little freezing action there. That was a lot to copy. That was a lot. Alright. Let's see. Can I twist this around? No. Alright. Should be a little bit of freezing because that was a lot to move. But there you go. We have the original Stargate Prometheus. We're going to use that to compare. And we have these little ships here. I believe this is just uh, comes standard with the game. I originally, I think I called this the Daedalus. And I believe that's wrong. I don't think this is supposed to be the Daedalus. But... Either way, we have five beautiful ships, one copied Prometheus, and we're going to get in here and we're going to see what we can get done. To save time, uh, uh, ah, yes, there we go. All right, I was going to say to save time, if I have difficulty getting in and out, I'm just going to throw a cockpit on top and slam her in there, but so far so good so you can kind of get a little peek around as I hop in and away we go now ideally I'm gonna crash into the front half of the ship so these other ones can get the back of the ship but I guarantee no promises because turning is not really our friend in this game it's uh, a little brutal. Even with the mouse constantly frantically turning, still just not a lot of action. Maybe if I put more engines or whatever on it, that may be a future video, but for right now, we're gonna keep this simple and we're gonna keep this fun future videos will will goof around more because I still have yet to do a video of me building something of my own so stay tuned for that there's gonna be a lot more alright see we kind of got just a little bit of hit action there Prometheus is actually moving not a whole bunch of damage of course that wasn't much of a crash that was kind of more of a, a bump turn 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 all right get a little forward momentum going see if we can hit it just going a little bit faster not probably too much okay so there's the first ship. We actually got it lodged, even though it kind of looks like it's going to pop out on its own. That's fine. Jetpack on. Ah. So there you see, that's um, two bumps, not really going too fast. A little bit of haul damage, nothing too, too severe. What about the next one? Whoa. Overshot, 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 overshot. Oh, vastly overshot. All right. Let's see here. 
we're actually going to cheat a little bit and put a cockpit on top of here for the interest of time. Uh, let's rotate you around. There we go. That way we don't have to keep on going through the vast pain of in, out, running around. We can simply crash more often. So this time, we're going to get a little bit of speed built up. I'm going to try to steer just a little bit. Although, not having too much luck. Ah, there we go. So that's, you know, that's, that's not bad. Um, kind of bent the, uh, the hull a little bit. Made a hole. Nothing too super spectacular. So we could repeat that over and over again, but I do believe there's a small ship around here somewhere. It's always a really small ship. Is that it? Is that it? No. No. What about over here? What about you? Hmm. Oh, go forward, go forward, go forward. Go forward. All right, well, this is not the small ship that I was gonna aim for, but it's here, it's ready. Although I'm having very hilarious bouncing issues. Ah! So we are going to slap a cockpit on it. There we go. Let's get on in here. Boom. <laughs> Ramming speed! Uh, blah, 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 blah. All right. That was such an impact it actually threw me off the ship, which I would hope to be the very least of the destruction. And it looks pretty darn good. Look at that. Got a little hall bending. Uh, nothing interior. But definitely some outside structure. I got a little bit of interior distress here. But overall, still standing. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to call this a video. But later on today, stay tuned because there's going to be another one. I'm going to load back up the, well, maybe not the Prometheus. Maybe we'll flip to a different ship. But I'm going to find the small ship. I'm going to replicate a whole bunch of them around whatever ship I decide. And we're just going to smash, smash, smash. Such a beautiful update. Probably not what the creator intended at all, but you know, what can you do? So thank you, everybody. Stay tuned. Like I said, later on today, there's going to be that other video. So stay tuned. And as always, I appreciate your support. I'll see you next time. Peace.